R2-D2, Your Highness. Welcome back, Star Wars fans, to SMKR. This is your host, Steve. Up next is the Model Space Build Your Own R2-D2. This is issue 43. Here's the magazine, and here are the kit parts. In just a little bit, we will take these out, give you a closer look at the parts. We'll assemble this issue, and then we'll look at the magazine. I'll be right back. Here are the parts that were contained in the bag and they're all inside this nice little blister pack. I'll take them out and we'll get a closer look. Here's a close-up view of issue 43 parts. These are the left ankle components. We'll start off with the first plastic piece, which is the left ankle detail, they call it. And then these four parts up here are metal. And we have uh, some little end caps here. And these they're just all called details. They're not real specific. And I, I believe these are plastic. Yep, they're plastic. So these are the metal, plastic, and plastic. Be right back and we'll assemble it. To assemble this issue, you'll need to retrieve some of the screws out of your screw box. You'll need two silver 2x6mm two screws. And these are the smaller ones, like this right here. You'll notice you have the 2mm, but it has a, a larger uh, shank on it. So this one right here, they actually will fit, it's threaded to fit in those. So they are the smaller ones, remember that. You will also need two of the black 2.3 by 6 millimeter self-tapping screws, and these are to mount metal to plastic. Also in assembling this issue, we'll need the left ankle plate and the screws, of course. Be right back. Let's assemble these ankle fittings. We, we're actually going to be doing this twice. I'm going to just show you once. Take these away. And it's just a simple a lining up things here. All we have to do is uh, line up the slots here with each other. You'll see there's a slot on each side here. And it kind of goes like that with a spacer in between. We'll put the spacer on. And then we'll line this up just like that. And then we'll take our two by six millimeter metal screw. Insert it. Just like that. And we'll tighten it down. And there's one of them. Be right back with the other one assembled. Right. Next we'll insert those into the flange fitting. They're both assembled just like uh, I showed you previously. We'll get this, the flange fitting here and they kind of key in also. And with this uh, tab here that sticks out it's going to be on the bottom. So it kind of keys in. You can see there's a slot here and a slot right there. So that will, that will key in with that. And this tab here will be on the bottom because that mounts to our ankle bracket. Same thing on this side. I'm going to key in on the slot there. Slide in. Kind of snaps in. That way this keys into this bracket here, just like that. And then these two slide down on top, just like that. We'll turn it over and we will put the screws in into these holes right here on the round part. Remember these are the self-tapping black screws.
I'll get the other one started before I tighten it down. Put that on. Use your self tapping. There you go. Turn it over. And that's what it looks like. And that's what it looks like. That completes issue 43 assembly. Stay tuned for issue 44. Now let's look at the magazine. I'll be right back. Here's the magazine for issue 43. Let's look through it real quick. Same thing, building the galaxy, droid directory, understanding robotics, and then actually building this issue. We have the bare necessities. Then we get into designing the Ewoks. And uh, Polis Mason, medical droid. Lots of stuff uh, with the Star Wars universe I never really uh, knew about and until you know you get this magazine. Carnegie Mellon University and this is robotic technology that they're talking about here and then we get into the left ankle components that we just assembled and all the steps that we did for the assembly which was kind of fun I thought and we'll look at what we have coming up in issue 44. Here's issue 44 Thanks for watching everybody. Happy modeling.